I'm a little nervous. Let's just try one, see where it goes. Okay. Action. Action. Hi, I'm Louise. I'm a medical builder from Simi Valley, California. I want to be on Wheel of Fortune. That's a great start. I'm just checking focus here. <laughs> Can I do another? Yeah. You paid for the full hour, so we can do as many ticks as you need. Uh, we just need, oh, can you fix that hair for me? Thank you. Great. So we just need a little bit more from, sorry, it's my sister. Oh, is this a bad time? No, 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 I'm just, um, I'm seeing her tomorrow for my niece's baptism because I'm the godmother. <laughs> oh, congratulations. Thank you. Yeah, so uh, like I was saying, we just need a little bit more from you. Uh, hi, I'm Louise, I've been a lifelong fan, and then just a fun fact. Okay, but technically I didn't start watching until the seventh grade. They won't fact check that. Okay, action. Hi, okay, I'm Louise. Okay, wasn't recording there. Oh. I'm just gonna let it run. Okay, action. Hi, I'm Louise. I've been a lifelong fan of Wheel of Fortune ever since age 12. In my spare time? In my spare time, I like to go to my neighbor Soph's casting office and have her make a Wheel of Fortune audition tape for me. I love that you want me in your video, but you're paying me. It's all about you. Fix that hair again. <laughs> yeah, great. Remember, they just want to hear something interesting about you. Okay. Uh, action. Hi, I'm Louise. I've been a lifelong fan of Wheel of Fortune for most of my life, except for the part of my life before age 12. Uh, something interesting about me is my best friend growing up always seemed like she was in love with her dad. Like, in love, love. Okay, cut. Uh, I don't know why you mentioned that part about your best friend. Me either. Okay, uh, I think you're getting in your head a little bit, so why don't we... Sorry, my sister won't leave me alone. Um, I have to take this, sorry. Hi, I'm at work, what's up? Do you need anything? What? Seriously, you don't want me to be the godmother? Well, who then? Marcy and Greg, Phil's friends, the crazy preppers? Survivalist. Survivalist, whatever, so it is personal. It's, it's nothing but personal. Oh my God, it is a big deal. Was this even your idea? It was our idea. Our idea, so Phil, yeah, and you didn't stand up for me. Cool, cool, cool. So you, you don't trust me. You don't trust me and you don't respect me. That's what it is. I well, well, Phil doesn't. And you always do this to me. You always fucking do this. You say you're gonna do something and then you promise it and then you take it back and then like, I mean, I was supposed to speak at dad's intervention. You wouldn't let me do that. You didn't, you didn't vouch for me on that home and like I fucking lost that. And now like, fuck you, fuck you both. Like fuck Phil and oh my God. Oh my God, no, I'm not gonna deal with a caterer. Are you insane? Are you fucking insane? Cause I'm not coming. If you didn't realize that I'm not coming. No. No, 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 I'll pray for you. I, I'm gonna pray that my niece doesn't end up like a, like a spineless, backstabbing bitch like you. <laughs> I fucking always do this. Is everything okay? Yeah, let's just do this. I really appreciate you helping me. Yep. Um, it seemed dramatic. <laughs> Fine, just, just let's go again. Okay. Uh, action. Hi, I'm, uh, I'm uh, Louise. I want to be on Wheel of Fortune. Um, I like to hike. I used to hike with my friend Pappy. She slept in the same room as her dad. Sorry, sorry. Uh, I'm really scared right now. Um, uh, should we cut? Sure, cut. The fucking hair. Uh. I know what to do. I know what to do. And you can't trust me. Is it okay to mention that Poppy slept in the same room as her dad? Louise, do you think it's okay to mention your friend being in love with her dad on a video to get on Wheel of Fortune? Oh, no, it's just that it's all that I can think about. Well, then they're not going to pick you. Okay, I'll try not to. Let's not. 
Uh, okay, action. Hi, I'm Louise, and oh, she took him to prom senior year. They even rented a hotel room after. I mean, who it's does unbelievable. that? It's just unbelievable. Yeah, right? It's, it's unbelievable that Marcy and Greg are going to be the godparents. Oh, yeah, are they bad people? I mean, I don't like them. Yeah, that sucks. Yeah, they suck. Everyone sucks, and like now my niece is gonna grow up and like prep for doomsday and not believe in science and like join a cult or something. God. I'm sorry. Let's try this again. Remember, they just wanna see you being you. Okay, uh, action. Uh, hi, I'm Louise. I want to be on Wheel of Fortune. Pat Sajak is almost like a father to me at this point. No, no dad stuff. Right, no dad stuff. Um, hi, uh, I'm Louise. Uh, action. Uh, you know, you're having a really bad day. I am, but it's fine. Peter, you've been really patient with me, but I think I'm gonna rethink sending in the video. I can apply without one. No. No, we're, we're doing this. Uh, no, I can't get my friend out of my head. It's just not working. It, it, it will, trust me. I do, it, but it's not working. It is working. We can do this. Let me just show you how simple it can be. Hi, my name is Soph. I work in casting, and a uh, fun thing about me is I'm not godmother material. That's fun. <laughs> you obviously care about your niece deeply. This is just like on Wheel of Fortune, when when someone is about to solve the puzzle and then they land on lose a turn and then the next person solves the puzzle. And the puzzle is your niece. Yeah, it's just like that. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to make this about me. Can we do one more, please? Anything to make your day better. Thank you. Action. Action. Hi, I'm Louise. Oh, I can't stop thinking about my friend again. Louise, Louise, look at me. Uh, look at me. Take a breath. Let's both take a breath. Okay, you know when people say my friend, they're sometimes actually talking about themselves? Like, are you? Uh, yeah. Oh, no, 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 no. Uh, my friend is in love, love with her dad. I I'm not in love, love with my dad. I mean, I loved my dad. We watched Wheel together for years. He passed away in 2016. But every night I still feel like he's watching it with me. And I know if I got on, he'd be chanting, big money, Louise, big money. <laughs> Although, to be honest, he was more of a Jeopardy fan. Wheel was my show, Jeopardy was his, but we watched him together as a block. I think we got it. Really? We can edit. <laughs> Cut. Do you feel good? Yeah, I do. I hope they pick me. Yeah, me too. Listen, I know how to get a hold of some murder hornets. What? If you wanted to send one to your sister or Phil or Mercy and Greg. No, uh... Just saying, my cousin Marissa is an entomologist in Seattle. And when we were kids, we used to mail crazy things to people we didn't like all the time. Dead butterflies, spider eggs, spider legs. <gasps> That's what I should have said instead of my friend being in love with her dad. Can I do another? Sure. Action. Ted? Yeah. Where's Karachi? Geographically. It's missing? Yeah, I, I pulled it. What? I told you I was saving that one. 
We need to wait here. You actually finished it? Yeah, yeah, it's here. Now, let's see, I know it is you're somewhere. Uh, um, I will be right back. Oh, I'm sorry. Liz? Hey, Ted. It, it, it's great to see you. I didn't think you were going to be coming. Surprise. Wow. Great. <laughs> Uh, I am so sorry. Let me, I just got to grab this real quick. Um, you know, the doors actually don't open for a little while. I can step away for a bit if you want to uh, go grab something to eat, maybe. You sure? Absolutely. Yes, a thousand percent. Um, let me just go uh, hang him. I will be right back. You know what? I actually forgot. I need to grab all of this. Just, I'm gonna get you a bottle of water. Hang tight. Just. Hey. Uh... No, devi trovare qualcun altro che si occupi di quel corso. Ciao, a me piace Nassim, ma non è bravo con gli studenti. Ha fatto piangere una vedova al campito perché non riusciva a configurare più per cibo. Ehi, hey, uh, uh, ne parliamo dopo. I gotta go. Everything okay? Work. <laughs> uh, another big wave of migrants. Mm, it's hard not having me in country. Well, I mean, you're valuable. Work's important. Wish I had that. Boss not appreciative of your talent? Oh, no, no, no. Bonnie is great. And Loyal's could be... She actually helped set up the art exhibit. So, I mean, yeah. I sent a bike coming. <laughs> yeah. Butts don't do that. Oh, God. No, she, she's just, you know, trying to push me out the nest. You know, like guys like you, tasting talent like you. What are you still doing here? Valid question. I guess I shouldn't have expected sympathy from a professional nomad. Jeez. <laughs> no, I, I get it, really. I mean, who wouldn't want to stay home in the town they never left, the 18 places and things they're never going to see? <laughs> Seriously, though, it'll do you good to get out of here. Yeah, I, I mean, I will, you know, when the time's right. Just, uh, anyway. There is an amazing cafe just a few streets down this way. I think it would be the perfect setting for our very first in-person pen pal soiree. Um, well, it's 5.30, Ted. Not exactly latte hour. Oh, come on. The night's still young. The sun's still out. And I'm besides, we're going to be driving home anyway. Like, you know. New anxiety prescription, the caffeine screws with the meds. Think you can manage a little celebratory champagne instead? Huh? As long as I don't overdo it. Yeah? Sounds perfect. Perfect! Let's get some champagne! Woo! It's beautiful, isn't it? Lake's actually one of my favorite spots. It looks more a river to me. Well, the river, it actually doesn't flow anywhere. It's called Knoxville. It's dammed up on both ends. I love it. It's very serene. Josh loved it, too. We spent a lot of summer days here. I mean, actually, I was baptized right down there. Oh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and then my friends preferred a little down the way for uh, less wholesome things. Oh, did uh, Ted partake? Oh, no. Oh, God. No, 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 no. No, I prefer it here. It's way less crowded. Thank you for coming. It really means a lot. Of course.
Um, I have something for you. Oh, Ted. I hope you like it. Uh, it's beautiful. My parents love this beach. I never got to see it before we left. No. That's so sweet of you, Ted. Thank you. You want to yeah. ask that and get the get it, card sorry. going? Yeah. <laughs> I just, um, I, I've, I've been nervous about meeting you all day, and I was really hoping I wouldn't be. Why is that? Because I actually do have feelings for you. Whoa! Oh! Whoa! <laughs> Wait. What? You, you have feelings for me? That's what I said. <laughs> That's why you make me nervous, but... I feel so silly saying that because I know we would never work out. Wait. Charming. <laughs> oh. I'm sorry. I, I don't understand. Well, I mean, for one, you don't feel the same way, and you've moved on, dated other people. I didn't just move on. That's not funny. Oh God, no, 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 that, that's not how this was supposed to go. <laughs> how was this supposed to go? You weren't supposed to like me. I'm, the only reason I even said anything was because I was sure, I was sure that you didn't. That was supposed to make it easier. No, 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 you were the one that didn't want to date, like what? Three years ago? God, three years? Yes. Yeah. Meg is like, oh, I got this great friend. You should meet her. Reach out on Facebook. And after two months, you're like, oh, sorry. I just don't see you that way. In fact, you said that I you know, I know what I said. So what, I mean, you, you just like lie about it? No. Right I mean, I don't know. I just. I wasn't sure until now. I didn't see a scenario where it would work out. The distance, I was about to move abroad. You seem to be going in your own direction. Why'd you have to be so damn romantic? I wasn't trying. Yeah, that's for sure. This can't work. Why? You're rooted here. I'm not, not anywhere. I don't even know what home is anymore. New Orleans was never the same after Katrina. Not going back to the motherland. And Arkansas, what a joke. You know, sometimes people can make a place feel like home. Even just a person. Like your brother? That was Josh, wasn't it? The one you just finished. No. That's a hell of a way to capture a man drowning. My father won't look at it. He, uh, says it's too ghoulish. See, that's what's good about you, Ted. You know how to process and handle your shit. Emotionally stable. Creative. Smart. Occasionally funny. You can stop. I already tried to find reasons not to like you. I failed. Clearly. Okay, well then, I mean, why no? Like, why yes, I like you, but... Just think about it, Ted. In a month, I'm leaving again. Well, to finish out a contract. Yeah, and afterwards, they're gonna pay for me to finish school. Uh, that's fantastic! And, and then after that? I wanna stay. You think I'd hold you back, don't you? That's not fair. Liz, I can do what I do, 
anywhere. Then why aren't you? We have been long distance friends for so long. I mean, what, what, what's another step further, really? And how long is that gonna last? You're gonna come join me in Italy? Oh, for you? Yeah, why not? For me. Yes, for you! It's crazy. Like, ever, ever since we met, every girl I've ever been with, I've always quietly in the back of my head compared to like, you know, it's always the butt, and that's the thing. I'm like, I wish they were more... So that, that, that's it, we're just gonna go back to being each other's internet crushes and... It sucks, I know. If I'd just known how you felt... Maybe there'll be another chance. I cannot count the number of times I wanted to tell you how I felt about you. I've always felt selfish. <laughs> anyway, this, uh, thanks for be in there and bring it up. She ain't that. You're mad. No, I'm not mad. I mean, what kind of friend would I be? So you're... Yeah, I'm this way. I mean, I can walk you if you want. Can... No, it's fine. Uh, you gotta get back. Are we good, Ted? You okay? Yeah, we're... Yeah, I'm good. We're, uh... It, it, was, it was nice, uh... Like, me meeting you doesn't really feel right after knowing each other for so long. I just, uh... I know. Excuse me. Shout out to you.
I see it isn't just the pastries from La Voile you brought back with you. Check him out, Tidwell. Slick garb. I tell you, boys, no better than Europe. The moment I got there, I found the finest tailor in a corner shop off Champlise. Here he goes again. Yeah. Yeah, but I always believe the suit makes the man. No matter your look, you get the right get up, the right fit, the right threads, you always get respect. Look at you guys and you're ready to wear suits. Bet you bought it at Sears and Roebuck. I can say it doesn't matter where you get it so long as it's one of a kind and bold. You got something good, you know? Yeah, I've been to Paris and Milan and London. I've flown out of each one with a brand new, handcrafted, bespoke suit. But I know that it was made with precision, Heart, soul. It's not style, boys. For me, it's a way of life. Each time I get measured, I'm in a different place, and I know no matter what, I'll get something special. I can tell you the garb I get. When I wear it, I almost feel as if I can actually breathe. I feel lifted. So yeah, I go around the world because I love that feeling. I love to have that class. And I tell you, you ain't getting that in this town. Don't take RC, only coke.
Napoli. From Milan. Three dollars per linear yard.
Mr. Bellamy? No need to see it. Okay, we have seen what we need to see. We will call you should a position become available for you. We have other people waiting. Sir, would you stand? Flim silhouette, tailor fit bespoke our gather. Whoa, notch lapel, thin, single breasted, three buttons, no cuffs on the pants, straight legged, relaxed at the thigh, yet snug at the ankle. Bold vest, thick fabric, 100% cotton. Floral, easy, outside pieces, daring, complex, under pieces. Sir, where did you get this suit? He made it himself. Show me. It's just to be a janitor. Seems a bit excessive, but if excessive means I've just seen one of the best suits ever made, I'll take it. You know what this tells me, sir? If you made what you made for an interview, for no money, in this shed, imagine, just imagine. Imagine I bought you everything you need and paid top dollar for you to make me a suit. Bespoke, of course. And my friend, I have many connections. Mr. Bellamy, what would you say? Arms up, please.
Hey, are you Jin? Yeah. Nathan, good to meet you. Um, the professor said I could read with you today? Yeah, sure. Um, hey, Kitty, can you move to the back, please? Thanks. Thanks. Just a few announcements. We have a new player today. We have Nathan on clarinet. And don't forget, we have chair assessments this week, so play pretty. Okay, Jim. Great. Molly on the shore, top. clarinets, second clarinets, can we hear you from the top? I think you played a B natural at measure 17. Yeah, that was, that was dumb. I can mark it. A little shorter, please. Nathan, sounds good. All right, same spot. See you tomorrow. Come prepared. Hey, so for the assessments, he just assigns our chairs based on how well we play in rehearsal? Yeah. Okay, cool. Well, great to meet you, Jin. I'm gonna go get practicing, so. Me too. Cool, see ya. Flutes from 91. Thank you. French horns, same place. Horns, clean it up. Everybody at 91.
All right, cheering results on my door in the morning. you play piano? Sorry, I totally just barged it's, in on you. You're fine. It's fine. Uh, you sounded great on Granger this week. Thanks. You too. <laughs> Thanks. Were you first chair at your last school? Uh, no. I wasn't a music student. Uh, I realized how much I loved the clarinet, so I figured I'd stop fighting it. I had no idea you played piano. <laughs> Not really. Just working on a little thing. Sounds great. What is it? Just a little song. That you wrote? It's just a verse and a chorus so far. Can I hear? Please? <laughs> really? Just a little bit. Okay. Don't laugh. I won't. If this goes somewhere, then it goes somewhere. But if not, you show me I can be loved. Spread a little blanket on the forest floor. Have a picnic with myself, I'll toast to you. Hey, Jim. Hey.
Omni, diagnostics. Power optimal. Projections optimal. Sensory recall optimal. Holographics very poor. Upgrade vital. Third party software not compatible. I sense tension. I sense tension. Well, I'll give you tension, Omni. The time is 9.17. Wait, what? The time is 9.17 no, Okay, got it. Thanks. Nuts. I sense tension. Check your phone. Hello, Shay. Wow. Uh, I know you have a thing for me, but this is hinting toward restraining order territory. We have the biggest presentation of our careers, and this is how you act? You'll be the end of me. I sense tension. <laughs> really? Oh, come on. Okay, listen, just, just relax a little bit, all right? Just, there it is. That's a spot. You all right? Okay. Okay, Teddy, we start in 15 minutes, okay? Bullet points. Okay. A thanks for attending our demonstration on memory rehabilitation for those recovering from Alzheimer's. Combination of nanotechnology pharmaceuticals and... Natural practice of sensory recognition. Mm -hmm. Five distinct senses for a specific memory. Listen, I know you're up to something. So whatever it is, get it done fast. I won't keep working your schedule for you. Okay. Yeah. She'd be proud of you, Ted, for what you're doing here. No, 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 no. What we are doing here. Okay, listen, Shay, we are going to knock this out of the park. All right? <laughs> no. and by the, yes, absolutely. <laughs> and by the end of it, we will have changed the landscape on this stupid disease. All right? <sighs> gotta go. What, Ted? Yeah, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go. Hey, you're not as clever as you think. Yeah, don't act like I'm an idiot. Dr. Rose was... Just come with us, Doctor. Okay. We found an intruder in our top-tier level 5 classified alpha laboratory. What's that? Exactly. She showed up out of thin air in our most secure room. No camera footage showed her entering. No ID. We're running a DNA profile now. What does she have to do with me? We found this on her person. That would do it. It's on you. We'll be watching closely. Can I... Get you a coloring book or juice box or anything? 
Vous parlez français, non? I studied French in middle school. I can translate. I don't know what you're... Vous parlez français, espagnol, allemand, japonais, russe, et vous êtes actuellement en train de prendre le latin. Que préférez-vous? Uh, le français. Uh, qui êtes-vous, mademoiselle? Je m'appelle Obi. Plus de questions. Un noir à la mémoire, Théodore. Votre appareil pour appeler la mémoire, utilisez les cinq sens pour recréer du souvenir. Théodore, nous n'avons pas le temps. Il va dire que vive qui je suis, puis il va vous prendre. Pourquoi moi? Fermez les yeux, maintenant. Oh, I think I got that one. She said, close your... I know I can even trust you. You don't. That's why they call it trust. Stand still. Don't you? Yeah, well, an idle mind is a brain dead. Hey, whoa, 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 whoa. What do you think you're doing? Stop. Stop touching. Stop touching. Okay? Start talking instead, now that I can breathe a minute. What about? Um, let me see. I don't know. Where are you from? How did you get in the alpha room? Why are you in my life right now? What's your favorite color? You know, things like that. 2068, sensory recall, passphrase. Blue. Let's go back to that 2068 part. The year 2068. Pardon the interruption, sir, but it's a girl's DNA. And you really need to see this. Detain Dr. Rose right now. Yes, sir. So if you're from 2068 and time travel exists, they haven't had any progress in the orthodontics industry? Red flag says I. who denies time travel will ever exist is the same one who, in fact, invents it. What? Your fellow employees and their muscle are coming here now. You said you would help me see her again. Why? It might be hard for you to believe. Oh, God. It always. Go for the Grand Slam. In 2068, memories, knowledge, emotions, and information can all be hacked. And this time, a tyrant has taken control with only one mind he hasn't tapped into. Yours. You created a kill switch if you fell into the wrong hands. It would kill you, but your secrets wouldn't be the enemy's property. We have you back, but in a comatose state. It's these secrets that can overthrow him and revive you. There's a passphrase we need to do so. The prompt is, why it begins. I left her on her last night alive. Her brain deteriorated. A vegetable, skinny. I left her. Why? I don't know. I don't know. She wouldn't have left me. 
her baby. So I try to go back, even though it's not real, to be with her, to not leave. <sighs> there are two types. <sighs> there are two types of potent memories, Obi. Ones of great regret and ones of great love. How do you? You can't run from everyone forever. You can't shut everyone out. You have to love again, trust again, not be alone. No one to know, no one to lose. And also no one to get. Now stop feeling sorry for yourself. Stop focusing on the negative. It's bleeding you. People die, Theodore. And even more will if you don't help me. Now come on. Remember the good times. Even the small ones, Ted. My name is Maybe Shay Ming, and I am your granddaughter. Are you now? Unauthorized personnel approaching Dr. Main. I need the phrase. Countless lives depend on it. Grandpa, I can get you to her. Love like death changes everything. It's gotta be it. Shay, huh? Did you get it? That was it. Now we need to retrofit this more for travel. Latest holographics upgrade? Up, uh, yeah. Yeah. Hello, my Obi. How may I help you this time? Omni 5, run it. Sequence initiated. Subject lost. Enter. You did. You helped me, I'll help you. Your consciousness will go back. You won't have much time when you're there. With her, in the hospital, right?
survivor of the DSV Intrepid. Everyone else is gone. This is Lieutenant Kaya Torres. Please respond. Cosmic beings. Space pirates. Come on, throw me a bone here. This is Lieutenant Kaya Torres. Please respond. Hello? Yes. Hello? Yes. You hear me? Yes, yes. You hear me? Can't believe it's so. Where's the fucking signal so far? Three thousand five hundred and forty-three percent increase. Yeah, that should work. Hello, stranger. My name is Kaya Torres. I'm marooned on my life pod. I have a busted ship and I am circling a black hole against my will. Please send help. actual person. Wish I could say I'm sending a rescue crew, but I'm in the same situation you are. Not circling a black hole, though. Did you take a wrong turn? Navigation didn't have the latest, here's a black hole, you shouldn't fly here update? <sighs> Funny. Honestly, I'm surprised you reached me at all. The atmosphere here. Oh, did I mention I'm on a planet? I'm a cartographer. I make maps for a living. Or I did, until I crashed on a rock so massive it won't let me back out. Gravity. Always fun. I've been trying to initiate a proper calm link, but between your gravity problems and mine, we have a serious time displacement going on. Kaya Torres from the doomed Intrepid, if you want an interstellar pen pal, feel free to drop me a line. No one should be alone out there. So what do I call you? Map boy? I've been busy fighting physics. This pot has just enough juice to keep me from getting swallowed up. But if I modify the power flow, I think I can punch my way out of the well. That's the idea anyway. You don't realize how quiet space can be until you're drifting in it. I thought I'd be okay, but fuck, I'm... I could really use a pen pal right now. Mm. You're still there. I wasn't expecting to hear from you again. Hammer. My name is Hammer. Hammer? Yes. That's my real, actual name. I think my father wanted me to be a blacksmith or a lawman. Definitely not a cartographer. You hear that? That's a massive sandstorm going on outside my cave. The planet has them constantly. You'd die if you stood in the middle of one. They scare me. Every time. Uh, is fuck a curse word? 
Fuck. <laughs> a little click at the end. Lovely. <laughs> what? How have you never heard the glory which is the F word? It's fucking timeless. Also, why cartography? Was it to get back to your parents for naming you Hammer? I wanted to explore. Find places no one had ever seen, be remembered for something when I'm gone. <laughs> wow, that sounds really egotistical when you say it out loud, doesn't it? <laughs> what do you do, Kaya? What's your passion? I'm an engineer. <clears throat> I tinker, I fix things. When you're a mechanic, you're constantly solving puzzles. Space has the best puzzles. I've cooked this local abomination of a vegetable 46 different ways. Crispy, steamed, fried, it doesn't matter. It's always disgusting. At least you don't have to suffer through pre-processed rations and nutritional pills every day. I'm eating a fucking mystery meat. Oh God, I miss meat. Here's a list of foods I wish I was eating. A block of cheddar cheese. An avocado. Actually, just an avocado. No, they're long gone. Yours? It used to be me and my mom. She was a master mechanic, lover of puzzles, all around firecracker. Taught me everything I know. A few years ago, she got meth rash. You're prone to it when you work in the belly of a ship long enough. And the lining in your lungs breaks down and It's shitty how frail we are. What's your biggest fear, Hammer? You can trust me, I won't tell. To be forgotten. What's yours? To die alone. than before. I'm trying to conserve resources as much as I can. I'm losing ground. Bit by bit. Oh, maybe I should stop trying. One final adventure. There are worse ways to go, right? I'm so scared, Amber. Hey. Don't give up. I'm not going anywhere. I'll keep my line open, okay? One of us needs to escape. Can I get a picture of you? I want to put a face to this voice.
cowards don't do your justice, Kaya. Guess what I'm drinking? <laughs> Vodka. It's supposed to be for cleaning, but... I have a confession. Um, I have been thinking about you, and I kind of wish I was on that planet right now. Um, I don't know what vodka is, but I like the mood it's putting you in. Wait, 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 hold on, wait. You don't know what vodka is? How? I'm beginning to wonder if you're real at all. Explain, sir. Is my sheltered upbringing showing? Figures. This is what I get for being raised on Tremamine. Tremamine. I suppose you're going to tell me I wouldn't be fit for a... Tremamine. Coupling, either. Let it be known I am fully knowledgeable in such things, if you were here. Time out, I've never heard of Tremamine. Is it near Titan? Or Jupiter? Is it one of those weird Jupiter moons no one talks about? Jupiter? Titan? Kaya, I've memorized every colonized system. I've never heard of those planets. How's that possible? No fucking way. Hammer, I'm sending you an energy signature. Do a scan on your end, tell me what you find. Fuck. I found it. But the signal's reversed. <laughs> what does that mean? It's the little stuff. It's the different curse words, it's the different planets, the alcohol. Your messages come in at the same delay every time. What if you heard my broadcast because it's not a black hole at all? I mean, shit, what if, it, what if it's a wormhole? But not to another spot in the galaxy. It's, um, to another universe, Hammer. You're in an alternate universe. And I think I can get to you. Slow down, remember gravity? Even if what you're orbiting isn't a black hole, you could be crushed just by crossing over. I can't fix my bucket of the ship without your help, Kaya. Don't plow into the unknown on a hunch. Don't leave me. There's nothing left the other way. Not anymore. If I burn full throttle, I can make it to your planet. Someone's gotta save your sorry ass. We're gonna escape together. That's how we solve this puzzle. Hang on, Hammer. I'll see you soon. Kaya. 
If you're watching this, it means you finally made it. I'm glad you did. You're probably confused right now. If you want to know the answer, it's gravity. Your favorite subject. You travel to the wormhole. Time on your end slowed down. What you experienced in days. In the meantime, I tried my best. Did. There's a storm coming in, and I. I think I want to go for a walk. There's worse ways to go, huh? I waited as long as I could, Kaya. So tired. I left some recordings for you on this terminal. At least one a day. Every day. And hopefully it'll keep you from being so lonely. If you fix my ship and you get off this rock, don't forget about me. I never forgot about you. Hello, new universe. My name is Kaya Torres. I'm trapped on a planet in the middle of fucking nowhere. I have two busted ships and my odds of escaping are terrible. But I'm alive, so if you need someone to talk to, drop me a line. No one should be alone out there. What? Paul? Hello? I thought we were gonna watch a movie tonight. Wait, wait. Okay. 
Bye. I'm only here to observe. I only do this for her. She's the only thing I could ever love on this earth. If this is wrong, then I don't want to be right. So for the next couple hours, it's me and you for the night. I just want to hold you in my arms like you were always mine, all mine. I do anything, anything to be in there. I give up everything, everything. Anyone, anyone For you, dear I'll do anything, anything To be in there What if he doesn't care about me? What if I'm wasting all my time Just to be seen? I can feel the loneliness creeping up I know I'll never ever give him up I know I'm wrong for feeling this way But when my mom was my age she was married with kids on the way I don't want to feel this way I don't want to feel this pain I just wanted to go away I do anything, anything To have you near I'd, I'd give, give up, up everything, everything, everything To get you here I'll be anyone, anyone, anyone For you dear for you too. I'd do anything, anything, anything To be in there Oh no I think you just saw me I probably should start crawling away Before you start calling the police on me They don't know I'm hiding in this bush I'm so silent you can't see me I'm just a tiny human being Whoa. I guess I'll just go home Cause they won't leave me alone Till next time, my dear, you'll be here. stare into the abyss like that. Management looks down on daydreamers. They killed my dream. Can you help me with the speaker? I can't get it to work. Did you have a good weekend? Mine was great. Well, it was great. Cat puked on the rug. Can't get it out. I did something wild. Took a loan out in my kid's name. Work. They didn't even ask questions. Ton of money. And she has her whole life. Make that up. You need a flathead or anything? I'll go get one for you, I'll tell you. You're tired, right? Can I help you with something, sir? You can answer a question about my neighbor. I'm not sure I can help with that. But of course you can. You were there last night. I caught you peeping on my camera. Well, it wasn't me. It was that guy over there. Look how weird. If you continue down this path, a jail cell is where you'll end up at. Surrounded by concrete walls and exposed bathroom stalls. Never take a shit in peace again. Look at me, my friend. I won't tell the police, but I have to tell her at least. So don't you ever do this again.
excuse me, I have to warn ya, but nobody, nobody puts Tiny Todd in a corner. You can take your footage and shove it, matter of fact I know that you're bluffing, you ain't got nothing on me. If you don't mind your business, you're winding with some stitches, or sleeping with the fishes, just wait and see. Dropped this last night. Stay out of my neighborhood. Oh yeah, it's about to get weird. You want to be somebody but no This love's a fire Ignited with passion Awaiting my actions Cause love won't wait for me up okay and I'm sorry but I want this to work I want us to work and I want I want to not fool around with the women's semi-pro soccer league anymore okay okay thank you and I want to stop going to the senior citizen swim lessons to look at their Cute old little heinies. Oh, that's all I wanted to hear. <sighs> did you not pay the electricity? Yes, Paul, I did. Okay, that's what everybody says. I, I'm gonna go find the breaker box. Ugh. Babe, I can't find the breaker box. I'm starting to get that tit sweat. I don't know what the problem is, but uh, maybe we can go back to my place and smash and grab? Whatever you think, Paul. 
And I need AC or else I'm gonna die. Anyway, we can do Thai food on the way. I need a good old fashioned BM if that's. Oh, I want a cat. You're so cute. Oh, can I Paul. Paul. Give up everything for lack of hair. 